I am about ready to probably kill somebody. Vaughn, I can't find what I'm looking for. Where's my banana boat tanning oil for my legs? <laughs> Your tanning oil? Um, no idea. Look, these things are not gonna golden bronze themselves. Go look in the laundry room. I need my banana boat. Banana boat! Did we throw it away? Did you throw it away, Vaughn? No! Me. Look, the camera's off. Nobody can hear you. Honestly, did you throw it away? <laughs> no, I did not. Liar! <laughs> You're lying on camera. Joel, I did not throw your tanning oil away. Where? Do you know what? I have others in my truck. I'll use it. It's more of a bronzer. It's not the same. So I'll make do. This is ridiculous. You lied to our subscribers. <laughs> I did not. We have bread, I could make him a sandwich. No, no, I'll think about lunch in a minute. Let's not do that. Take Lady Potty, put her in her crate, so we can go visit Dad. Focus on my face, camera. Um, we'll go visit Dad at the house. But I told Joel, I said, before I, <laughs> before I come over to the house, I have to make a bunch of stories for Instagram because Sephora is having their VIB sale, which it's kind of like the Nordstrom sale where they only have it like once or twice a year And so I always buy the things that I know that I constantly restock like I don't try I don't really try new products I just buy the things that I know I'm going to love so let me show you what I just showed on the stories if you're going to buy any makeup setting spray you have to try the Farsali rose gold skin mist it smells amazing and it literally transforms your face. It just makes your face makeup look like skin makeup. So if you have dry skin and have problem with like patching, this is so good. Like that's just, gosh, it's so good. And then beauty blenders. I know that there are the cheaper versions of beauty blenders and those are fine. I've tried them all because I'm like, oh, if I can get a cheaper one, great. But nothing compares to the original beauty blender. I'll put links to these in my description below. The product that I have used the absolute most longest is the uh, Brow Wiz Pencil from Anastasia Beverly Hills. Oh, definitely the mascara. Everyone always asks me what mascara that I'm wearing. It's the It Superhero Mascara. This is just my one of my faves. I have a lot of faves. Oh, I didn't show this on um, Instagram, but if you're looking for an under eye concealer that doesn't crease as much as most, I'm not gonna say that it doesn't crease, I just fix it through the day, but if you want one that doesn't dry out your under eye, this baby is for you. If you have oily skin and you don't need something that moisturizes underneath your eye, this is so good. So I'll have my favorites listed in description for you guys. Okay, now that we have that out of the way, now that I have zero stitch of makeup on my face, oh, <laughs> I have mascara from yesterday. Don't judge me, it's quarantine. I did wash my face though. <laughs> Didn't do that. <laughs> Recently we had our huge burn pile, which we reduced so much. That's kind of what's left and I didn't want to stay around and have that burn. So I'll just clean up all the rest of that. We got rid of most of this pile. This pile was like up almost to the fence high. It was a huge pile of junk. And then a lot of it is just not burnable. Like there's an artificial Christmas tree, a lot of debris, bricks, junk. Anyway, we are spending the day in the yard cleaning up today. And Bonnie is gonna meet us out here. And the boys are gonna work extra hard today. How come, Code? What was that? Say it one more time louder. Because we got in trouble. Because they got in trouble. When a neighbor comes over and tells you that your kids are doing something wrong, your kids are in twice as much trouble. That's no fun. That's the best way for a kid to feel remorseful for their actions, I think, is being put to work, realizing, oh, crap. That sucks. So, anyway, going to work. We are going to be cleaning out this shed. I just want to pee. Oh, well. In a little while, we won't be able to pee in this shed anymore because it's going to be cleaned out. So. No more peeing in the shed. This wall is going to come down because we don't need it. Um, I'm not going to do a lot with the shed. I really would like to get rid of this shed, but where it's cement, brick, I'm not going to take the time to uh, get rid of that. That's just too much work. So we'll just clean it up, make it look cute for the new homeowners. Kids are being thoroughly 
entertained, I hopefully in a safe you. way. Things don't look much different in here. Actually, they do. I can tell that Joel has this top layer that he shimmed that, I think from last time. Anyway, today's project, I told Joel, I said, while we are waiting on a few things for plumbing, flooring over there before he can finish that up, I said, what can we do? Like, what can we do to move forward? And he said, um, let's rip out the bathrooms. So guys, we're gonna rip out the bathroom today. We're at the dump, and instead of being able to just talk through to these Hold guys, me. You have to call in because they've got, you know, yes. the plexiglass between us and it's just a, definitely a different feel, huh, Joel? Oh, yeah. There's a place in Logan where they make, like, they uh, harvest beef and so the carcasses, they, <laughs> on certain days of the week, they'll come and dump them at the landfill to help break down the stuff. And one of the days I came and dumped, they dumped right next to me at the same moment and it was awful. Oh, so foul. So foul. That's foul, Joel. Yeah, I'm like, I'm gagging thinking about it. You watched it? Watched it, and I was like, Ooh. And at the bottom, why was it white, Joel? Because there was little buggies called maggots just eating everything that at the bottom of the bucket. That is... Like, I would have paid to have awful. seen your dad see it, though. Oh, <laughs> oh. He would have legit Girl. passed out. Okay, I'm sorry. Nope, I'm sorry, guys. I was, gonna... oh! I was going to record for you so you could see what it was like to dump here at the dump. I'm sorry. No, not worth it. Instead, the kids and I are going to search up maggots. Oh, search up maggots. Why are we here? Ugh, where's it coming from? <laughs> Everywhere! Eh, I'm just gonna breathe through my mouth so I don't have to smell it. It's kinda gross. No, because then you'll taste it. Ugh, that's even worse. Lincoln, did you make that? I only put the wood on. Olivia did? I only put the wood on. You did? <laughs> Olivia's is nailed, you guys. Good job. I tried to make a bike ram, but it didn't work out. Because every time I do it, a nail comes out. <laughs> okay, everyone's things are getting like crumpled. Bosti, are you mad? Why are you mad? Because you can't build anything. You can't build anything? No, 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 Okay, kids want to watch it. Hey guys, I don't think it's going to be that exciting. Okay, you ready? Yep. One, two, three. Somebody may have peed in there. Oh! Oh! Joel! But the plumbing is completely cut, so I can't even So get what water. do we do? I'll show you. Stop! You That's awful! I don't want to know what's happening right now. Well, in order to flush the toilet, you have to have so much water go into the bowl at one time and it will overpower the pee trap and go out. Really? Yeah. So, Olivia, when I say to turn the hose on, turn the hose on, okay? Go ahead. Turn it on. Yeah. No wonder the bathroom stunk. So it's gonna automatically flush? Joel? <laughs> there you go. So that just automatically flushed. Yeah. That's all you're doing. This, when you flush a toilet, all you do is take a couple oh. gallons of water and dump it in there and it overpowers the pee trap and goes out and then it creates a cycling effect. Wow. I'm not gonna lie, that was pretty amazing actually. I had no idea that that could happen. Kids, come here. Hey guys, come here. Go put those in the dump. Go put this in the trailer. Atlanta. 
faucet. Do you want an old sink? I have one that I'll let you have. It doesn't it work smells very good anymore. Really I'm taking bad. it out the door. And I crop dusted you on the way. <laughs> I hate you. <laughs> nice. You guys, this is the best. This That's is the best. Nice. Watch your knees. I do not. Oh, see how that saw just like went Don't down? Olivia, time. do not cut your knees. Yeah. You're right there? <laughs> You little sassy, don't you do that. What's on your hand? A saw? Ooh, ooh, careful when you grab it and like that. Oh, it's just your hand, thank goodness. Did it hit your head just now? No, wait. Oh, did that hit your head? Ear. Your, oh, did that hit your ear? I'll just stand in the shower. I think you've got the wrong person. Where's the heaviest end? Uh, well, end? I, this end's pretty, it's about even, but this I think has the best handles for you. So Which I, side has the least chance of getting water on someone? If you get water on it from this side, it's clean water. If you get water mm -hmm. on this side, it's pooping water. Okay. You know which end is mine. For the day, Joel went and emptied this trailer. Now it is, I don't know, it's pretty good and full. Here's the mostly empty bathroom. We think we're just gonna leave the shower for now. We're not really sure, but the floor is mostly up. That was not easy. I don't think we filmed very much of that. So you guys, I think we're gonna call it a day. Maybe we'll go for a bike ride with the kids tonight, yeah? Deal. Does that sound like a plan? Alright guys, thanks for watching. We'll see you in our next video. Bye guys! Bye.